Many elephant seals bask in the sun on the beaches at Piedras Blancas during the summer, with their skin coming off in patches as they undergo what is called a catastrophic molt. Instead of growing hair and skin cells throughout the year, elephant seals grow an entire layer of skin and all their hair as they rest on the beach for four to six weeks with an old layer of skin and all their hair falling off. This avoids the loss of heat they would experience at sea if they circulated their blood next to the skin while in the cold ocean water. The seals that have recently arrived are a dull tan or brown with patches of skin beginning to peel. The seals that are near the end of their molt have silvery new coats. They are also thinner than the new arrivals because they have not eaten during their molt. When they are finished, they will leave one by one to travel north and west to feed. Molting is a round-robin process as different age groups come in at different times. The females and juveniles come in to molt in April and May. In June, subadult males, the seal version of male adolescents, begin to arrive. In July, the adult males come in to molt after their semi-annual migration to Alaska. The subadult males are more fun to watch than the juveniles and females. Like most teenage males, they like to spar and play, challenging each other with their changing voices, banging their chests together, and nipping at each other's necks in mock fights. They may weigh a thousand pounds or more, and visitors who have not seen adult males are awed by their size. Juvenile males have pointed, rat-like noses, and as they get older, the nose widens. By the time they are sub-adults, they have noses that are beginning to hang down. When they reach maturity at about eight years old, they have the proboscis, that gives elephant seals their name. The females don't get it. The adult males bulked up after their feeding journey to Alaska can weigh up to 5,000 pounds, but they are in a more mellow mood than they are during the breeding season in the winter when they are vying for status and mating rights. In the summer, they are just here to molt. They may announce their presence with their booming voices, and they might spar with one another, but they are more likely to use their companions on the beach as pillows as they snooze and rest. In August, the males are leaving, one by one, to head to Alaska again to put on weight in anticipation of the winter birthing and breeding season when they will fast from late November until March. After they leave, there are not many seals on the beaches for about a month. Then young seals begin to come in to rest. Be sure to visit our website www.elephantseal.org and the video stream from our webcam.